today we are going to study about meaning and a scope of anthropology right meaning and a scope of anthropology right so this is the first topic when we are going to prepare anthropology for upsc exam right so this is introduction class 4 upsc 2022 and 23 as students so those who are interested to take anthropology as their optional paper and those who are in the course of thinking for anthropology so first important thing is that we have to understand meaning and a scope of anthropology this topic give us insight about what we will study in anthropology in future so first thing is that uh, when you try to understand meaning of anthropology so first uh, you have to understand etymological etymological meaning of anthropology etymological meaning of anthropology because it also gave us some important insight regarding anthropology so when we try to understand about etymological meaning of anthropology so that term anthropology that term anthropology is made up by two greek words right first anthropos anthropos and second is logos logos so etymological meaning of anthropos is man or human right or man and etymological meaning of logos means a study right so if we talking about a etymological meaning of anthropology it means anthropology is the study of is the study of man right or human being <coughs> a study of man or a study of human or scientific study of man or scientific study of human kind or man kind this is etymological definition so whenever you try to understand anthropology or whenever you try to prepare meaning of anthropology so you have to start from etymological definition of anthropology after that you have to remember some important definitions which given by some prominent anthropologist right we have to remember 
some important definition which given by some prominent anthropologist but when we study about the meaning of anthropology so always remember that generally upsc as question what is anthropology or define anthropology so we have some limitations because when question ask define anthropology or what do you mean by anthropology and then there may be some tail means you have to write about a scope of anthropology you have to write about nature of anthropology what is the relevance of anthropology in contemporary society these types of tail may be add in this question so when you try to define anthropology or when you try to write the meaning of anthropology so first you have to give etymological the meaning of anthropology and then you have to write the some important definition but i suggest you only two important definition first definition that definition given by mg harskovich harsk covids <coughs> this is very important for the understanding of meaning of anthropology and mg harskovich root a book name man and his works right <coughs> remember that this is the book written by mg harskovich and in this book ke mg harskovich define that anthropology is the study of man and his works so before that according to etymological definition anthropology is the study of man a study of man and mg harskovich said that anthropology is the study of man and his works so it means what mg harskovich said what mg Har harskovich want to say about anthropology so mg harskovich further explain that a study of man means a study of a study of biological evolution and biological variation biological variation of man means if we try to study about what mg harskovich to want to say in the study of man and his works he said that a study of man refer to a study of human biological evolution and human biological variation so for the study of human biological evolution and human biological variation anthropologist study primate evolution second human evolution on the basis of fossils remains human biology means anthropology interested to a study about human anatomy human physiology human osteology and then human genetics etc <coughs> so here a study of man refer to that aspect of mankind 
when you try to understand anthropology or meaning of anthropology. And second, M.G. Hartskowitz also said that a study of man works. So for the study of man works, anthropologist study evolution of culture evolution of culture on the basis of material culture remains material culture remains means here we are talking about archaeological anthropology means anthropologists are interested to study about human prehistoric culture or evolution of human prehistoric culture. And second, anthropologists also interested to study about cultural diversity of mankind. Cultural diversity of mankind. So for the understanding of cultural diversity of mankind, Anthropologists are interested to study about human society, both primitive as well as modern society. Anthropologists interested to study about marriage, family, kinship, economic organization, political organization, religion, custom, tradition, music, dance, drama, art. Anthropologists also interested to study about linguistic diversity of mankind. Linguistic diversity. Right? And therefore when we trying to understand about a study of man and his works, it means for the study of man, we study about biological aspect of mankind. And for the study of man's works, we study about this important aspect of humankind. This is very important. And that we will study in anthropology. So first you have to give attention about etymological definition of anthropology. And then you have to collect some important definition and through that definition you have tried to explain about meaning of anthropology or try to define anthropology. Second important definition here, I want to quote that was given by famous American anthropologist Clyde Kluckhorn. Clyde Kluckhorn. So Clyde Kluckhorn, he wrote a book named Mirror for Man. Mirror for Man. Right? This is an important work of Clyde Kluckhorn. In this work Clyde Kluckhorn said that anthropology is the mirror for man. And further he said that anthropology is the holistic study of mankind. Anthropology is the holistic study of mankind. Holistic study of mankind. in time and space. Right? So this is very important definition. When you try to define anthropology, when you try to write about the meaning of anthropology. So actually, Kluckhorn said that anthropology is that discipline Actually, Clyde Kluckhorn said that anthropology is that important discipline which 
a study about total aspect of mankind and their integration means anthropology interested to study about human biological evolution as well as human cultural evolution human biological variation as well as human cultural diversity in anthropology we study human genetics we study population genetics we study raciology we study epidemiology we study human ecology we study human growth and development we study human anatomy human physiology human osteology we study primatology we study paleo anthropology we study paleopathology for the understanding of biological aspect of mankind we follow holistic perspective biocultural perspective so when we study about human cultural diversity means human society primitive as well as modern marriage family kinship so we study about the diversity in marriage diversity in family pattern diversity in kinship pattern we also study about economic aspect of mankind we study about diversity in production consumption distribution and exchange system anthropology also interested to study about human political aspect in which we study about uh, different kinds of political organization like band tribe chiefdom and state we study about mechanism of social control in different types of political organization we study about process of law and justice in simple society as well as modern society religion is very important aspect of mankind and anthropology also interested to study about religion tradition custom dance drama music art human behavior anthropologist interested to study about human behavior human cognition human personality relationship between culture and personality human demography so when we study about anthropology we study total aspect of mankind and their interrelationship and therefore we can say anthropology is the holistic study of mankind but after that when we try to write about conclusion so one thing here i want to add in conclusion because we know that anthropology is applied science so anthropology is study total aspect of mankind for the welfare of human kind means it is a applied science so because it is applied science so knowledge and data gathered by anthropologist which is utilized for the welfare of human kind and therefore you can understand that thing in this way so this is meaning of anthropology or definition of anthropology <music>